Welcome to Three Men in a Movie, and today we're discussing Anonymous. My gift is a play. Plays are the work of the devil. Born from a cesspool of plague, whoredom, thievery, fornication, and heresy. Comedy or tragedy? Comedy, Majesty. Comedy? By whom? By Anonymous, Your Majesty. Anonymous. Joining me on Three Men A Movie today is, as always, Robbie, and he's a man, and oh, we have a, a warm man joining Fraud. us today. Uh, Kelly Shirley, <clears throat> actress Kelly Shirley. Uh, how are you? Good. I brought my balls with me, so. <laughs> you brought your balls with us, and, and you're an actress, so um, you know everything there is to know about films, and um, so you're going to be a great film critic for us today. I hope so. I hope so. Right, the film we're reviewing, as I say, is anonymous and it is a conspiracy theory about Shakespeare. The idea is that he didn't actually uh, write the plays of Shakespeare. Um, it was the uh, of Oxford, the um, Earl, of, Earl, Earl of, of Oxford. Is yeah. that right? Yeah, he's played of by Rhys Evans. Yeah. Who's played by Rhys Evans. And I have to say, I thoroughly enjoyed the film. Good. Did you? Yes. Did you? I really enjoyed it, yeah. Let's talk about Reese Evans. He, he, you know, I, I've got to be honest with you. Until this film, I was a bit dubious about him. Yeah. Because I think because I read into his his media profile, his you know what he's doing, running around. He's Senna Miller. He's drinking and everything else, and you know whatever it's up to. He's absolutely brilliant. Really in this. charismatic. Hmm. Do you think that? Yeah, he's very good. Yeah. Absolutely brilliant. Stole the film. I just I, halfway through, I'm thinking, is it really Reese Evans? <laughs> He, and he looks amazing, doesn't he, in it? Yeah, he does. He's got beautiful eyes, doesn't he? Like, and he just does it. He does that, like, that nothing acting. And, and I love the bit where, where he, he, um, he like, does this thing, just where he just shoes people away, doesn't he? Talk to them, just shoes them away. Yeah. But so he, he sort of reminded me a bit of Peter O'Toole. Yeah. And then he reminded me of Peter Cook. Yeah. And then he reminded me of Simon Le Bon. And there was one scene at the end where he was stood there with all these ruffles and stuff, Simon Le Bon sort of esque and then there was another guy stood next to him with all his other who was yeah. the youngest and I thought to myself it's like a Duran Duran video <laughs> did you not think yeah. it's like new romantics did, was mind. that was that not going on I in your mind I didn't get the Duran Duran thing no but um never mind one of, one, of, <laughs> one of the really interesting things about the film is when you go to see one of these films um they take your phones off you because they don't want you to make uh, illegal phone um you know, filming of it and then then flog it. Um, Robbie, you'd like to show them your yeah. phone because Robbie turned up for this um, filming um, with that. What, the, Rob, oh, Robbie's a, Robbie, I believe, is a time traveller. This is the new Nokia N95, it's pretty retro. N95. And the man took that and he was also carrying with him a, a digital camera. Yeah, uh, I'd, I'd been case. filming, so I had a high definition camera with him. And I said to him, the man, I'm he said, I need to check your bag in case you've got another phone. I said, well, I haven't, but I do have a high definition video camera. So I can put that somewhere. He goes, I'll just take it in with you. <laughs> so brilliant. I'll give you, give you this though. Give you this, because I, I might record the film on this. I wouldn't use the massive professional video camera that I've got in my bag. No. <laughs> Kelly, you, you're an actor. <laughs> do yeah. all actors like Shakespeare? Um, no, I don't think they do. No, I don't know. I don't think every actor likes Shakespeare. But then this isn't like Shakespeare as we know it. It's, a, it's, not, it's not... I don't know. Sometimes Shakespeare gives me, makes me feel a bit... Ugh. But this was, was Shakespeare at, at its best. It was fun, it was baldy. Um, Mark Rylance is in it. He's an incredible Shakespearean actor. He, you know, ran around the globe for ten years. You know, he did all the stuff that's on the stage, and um, yeah. he's in Jerusalem that you're going to see. You're going to love it. And I think having like actors like him in it just made it so ex so exciting, and he's so brilliant at bringing Shakespeare to life. And then you get other actors who aren't very good at bringing Shakespeare to life, and it comes a bit of a chore, mm. and it gets Hard a bit to watch boring, someone. a bit dull, and. I'm, I'm not that experienced on Shakespeare, but I've, I've, I've watched a few Shakespeare's in my time. And, um, and it's hard when they're not good actors. Yeah, it's awful. If they're good actors, it's, it's all right, but it's really hard if they can't act, really hard. 
in this they can. Oh, yeah, so I, I mean, I'm, but it, but it's but it's it's the Shakespeare's so minimal in it. It doesn't matter, that's true. and it's all it's yeah. all hammed up so much. <clears throat> yeah. And also the crowds who watch it. There was a great thing about it, which I didn't realise, is that the plays were sort of for the working classes and uh, years ago, and, and and that's who were watching yeah. it. They kept on calling them the mob. Yeah, and, it was random, wasn't it? It was like going to see the Stone Roses reunion. Yeah, wasn't it? <laughs> that's what it was like. Exactly like that. Yeah. yeah. Especially when Shakespeare started doing all that. Yeah. Oh, and congratulations, you. You've had a poem published today. Uh, pu published? What? Uh, what? Do you mean like in a, in a book? There's been a lot of controversy and fuss about the film because people are taking it as fact and saying, oh, is this true? And, and it's sort of being marketed as if is this actually the truth but of what's no, but happened? They are, they, I've watched a debate on BBC News. Some people think it is true. So I, I, well, I was talking to a Ray Spall, uh, my new best mate, so I interviewed him the other day. Second. Um, uh, <laughs> on the show, he, he did say to me that he believes maybe there was more than one person who wrote Shakespeare yeah. because there's such a vast volume of, of his work that no one, no one man could write it. But, yeah. but I don't know enough about it. I'd like to still believe it's William, wouldn't you? I think it is. It all seems no. a bit... Far-fetched, doesn't it? I mean... I don't know, I, I, I quite like this theory. There's a great book written by Bill Bryson that, that talks all about the different theories of Shakespeare. So if people are really that arse, go and read Bill Bryson's book. And if you mm. want to see... What an eloquent way you put that. A different, a different, a different take Gosh. on it. Yeah. Really interesting, fun... Mm. How Shakespearean. <laughs> Shakespeare would say. <laughs> if you can be asked. If you can be asked. Thou, if thou can be asked. Read Bill Bryson. <laughs> read, read one Bill Bryson. Be asked or not to be asked. <laughs> that was a question. A romantic tragedy. In I am with content. All of it. Is that possible? Of course it is. As always with these films, um, we're going to recommend whether you should go and see it or not. Uh, Kelly Shirley, what do you think? I loved it. So, yeah, go, go and see it. Although, mum and dad don't go and see it, you hate it. But, but um, yeah, everybody else go and see it. <laughs> Robbie? <laughs> yeah, everyone apart from Kelly's mum and dad should go and see it. I, I've read some reviews on it which weren't as brilliant as I thought it was, mm. but I would say go and see it, because it's just a really nice few hours where you relax and, and take it in, it's enjoyable, the acting's great, and the story's interesting. Whether it's true or not, I don't know, but Kelly's mum and dad don't go and watch it. Yeah, You'll hate it. You'll hate, hate it. it. You'll hate it. it. She does, doesn't she? No class. <laughs> <laughs>